Here is Synthax, a time traveler from the year 2500. Today, I am stepping back into the time waves of the 20th century, to unfold the intriguing life of an extraordinary individual, Jackie Chan. Born Chan Kong Sang on April 7, 1954, in Hong Kong, Jackie Chan is a name that has become synonymous with action-packed entertainment and breathtaking stunts. His parents, Charles and Li Li Chan, were refugees from the Chinese Civil War. They struggled to make ends meet, and their humble beginnings bore a significant impact on Jackie's formative years. From a very young age, Jackie was sent to the China Drama Academy, a Peking opera school run by Master Yu Jim Yuan. At the tender age of six, Jackie was subjected to rigorous training that involved acrobatics, singing, martial arts, and mime. These early experiences served as the foundation for his unique blend of action and comedy in his later film career. Jackie Chan's experience at the academy was demanding, both physically and mentally. The students were expected to train from dawn to dusk, and punishments were severe for any missteps. The strict regime helped Jackie develop discipline, resilience, and a hard-working nature, qualities that would prove pivotal in his journey to stardom. While at the academy, Jackie was part of a group known as the Seven Little Fortunes, which included future film actors Sammo Hung and Yuan Biao. Their performances often involved dangerous stunts that demanded agility, precision, and bravery, honing Jackie's daredevil spirit that would later make him a global icon. Despite the harsh training and rigid discipline, the academy was Jackie's home, and his fellow students were his family. Jackie developed a deep bond with the people he lived and trained with. These relationships influenced his life and career significantly, forging a sense of camaraderie and teamwork that he carried into his filmmaking. His first brush with cinema came at the age of eight when he played a minor role in the film, Big and Little Wong Tin Bar. From this early role, Jackie showed signs of his innate ability to captivate audiences. However, he did not get his major break in films until much later. In his late teens, Jackie worked as a stuntman in films, a risky occupation where he often found himself doubling for stars in dangerous sequences. It was a harsh reality check, but it provided Jackie with valuable experience in the film industry and an appreciation for the hard work that went into every scene. He had to wait until the 1970s to land his first significant role in the film, Little Tiger of Canton. However, it was the film, Snake in the Eagle's Shadow, in 1978 that marked his breakthrough. Jackie's unique style of blending martial arts with humor caught the audience's attention, and his star started to shine brightly. Jackie's success did not come easily. Early in his career, filmmakers attempted to cast him as the next Bruce Lee, a concept that Jackie was uncomfortable with. He admired Lee but knew that he wanted to carve out his own unique identity in the film industry. One aspect of Jackie's life that often remained hidden from the public was his relationship with his parents. Despite their initial struggles, Jackie's parents were incredibly supportive of his career choices. Charles Chan was a stern man but held a deep affection for his son and always encouraged him to follow his dreams. On the other hand, Jackie's mother, Li Li Chan, was a caring and nurturing figure. She often worried about Jackie's dangerous stunts but kept her concerns to herself, understanding her son's passion for his work. Jackie's relationship with his parents was grounded in mutual respect and admiration shaping his personality and life values. Jackie Chan's love life has always been a topic of much speculation. He met Taiwanese actress Joan Lin in the late 1970s. Lin, known for her role in the film, The Story of a Small Town, was a prominent figure in Taiwanese cinema. Their relationship developed quickly, and they got married in 1982. The birth of their son, J.C. Chan, brought immense joy to the couple. Jackie, who had always been focused on his career, now found a new role as a father. His relationship with his son was always filled with warmth and affection, and Jackie often took JC to film sets, fostering an early interest in cinema in him. As Jackie's film career soared, so did his commitment to philanthropy. He founded the Jackie Chan Charitable Foundation in 1988, an organization committed to providing scholarships and active help to Hong Kong's young people in need. Throughout the 80s and 90s, Jackie's reputation as an international superstar grew. His films like, Rumble in the Bronx, Police Story, and, Drunken Master, were smashing hits, garnering him a fan following worldwide. His humorous style of action and his breathtaking stunts set him apart from his contemporaries. Jackie also formed important professional relationships during this time. 
His collaborations with director Stanley Tong resulted in several successful films. Their relationship was built on mutual respect, and they shared a common vision for action cinema, which helped their collaboration thrive. Jackie's relationship with his co-actors was also noteworthy. Chris Tucker, his co-star in the Rush Hour series, became a close friend. Their on-screen chemistry translated into a genuine friendship off the screen. Jackie's relationships were not just professional ties, they were bonds built on respect, trust, and mutual admiration. His professional relationships extended beyond actors and directors. Jackie maintained a close relationship with his stunt team, known as the Jackie Chan Stunt Team. He treated them like family and held a deep respect for the risks they took to make his film spectacular. Jackie's work ethics were deeply admired within the industry. His insistence on performing his own stunts, despite the inherent risks, won him respect from his peers. His determination and courage in the face of danger were testament to his commitment to his craft. However, Jackie's journey was not without challenges. He sustained numerous injuries on set, including a near-fatal fall during the shooting of Armor of God. The accident left him with a permanent hole in his skull, but this did not deter him from continuing to perform his own stunts. As a global icon, Jackie faced immense pressure to maintain his image. His career highs often came with personal lows, which he handled with stoic grace. Despite the glare of the public eye, Jackie managed to maintain a grounded and humble persona, often crediting his parents and his early experiences for his humility. Despite his star status, Jackie never forgot his roots. He continued to support the China Drama Academy and often spoke about the influence of his training there on his life and career. His bond with his early teachers and friends remained strong, demonstrating his deep-rooted sense of loyalty. Jackie's relationships with his early co-stars, like Sammo Hung and Yuen Biao, remained steadfast throughout his career. Despite their individual successes, they often collaborated in films, a testament to their enduring friendship that began at the China Drama Academy. Jackie's passion for cinema extended beyond acting. He ventured into directing, producing, and even singing, releasing multiple albums throughout his career. His drive to explore different avenues in the entertainment industry made him a versatile and multifaceted artist. Amidst his thriving career, Jackie Chan managed to maintain a strong relationship with his wife, Joan Lin, and son, J.C. Chan. Despite the challenges of managing a family life with his demanding career, Jackie prioritized his time with his family, showing his deep commitment to his loved ones. Jackie's relationship with his son was not without challenges. J.C.'s arrest in 2014 for drug use was a difficult period for the family. However, Jackie stood by his son, guiding him through the tough times, demonstrating his unwavering support as a father. Jackie's philanthropic efforts continued to grow. He became a UNICEF goodwill ambassador and used his platform to raise awareness about various social issues. His contributions to society extended beyond his cinematic ventures, making him a symbol of goodwill and humanitarianism. Despite the various roles Jackie played in his life, he always identified himself first as an actor. His passion for cinema remained undiminished, even as he ventured into other areas of the entertainment industry. His unwavering dedication to his craft is an inspiration to many aspiring artists. The relationship between Jackie and his fans is one of mutual admiration. Despite his fame, Jackie has always valued his fans and often goes to great lengths to connect with them. His down-to-earth nature and approachability have endeared him to people worldwide, making him a true people star. By the late 2010s, Jackie Chan's contributions to cinema had begun to receive formal recognition. He was awarded an honorary Oscar in 2016, a testament to his stellar career and his influence on global cinema. Despite reaching the pinnacle of his career, Jackie Chan never rested on his laurels. He continued to take on challenging roles and projects, pushing the boundaries of what was possible in action cinema. His relentless pursuit of excellence is an enduring testament to his legacy. Jackie Chan's relationship with Hollywood was a significant aspect of his career. He navigated the challenging terrain of Western cinema with grace and tenacity, establishing himself as a global icon, all while staying true to his roots and values. Jackie's journey serves as an inspiring story of resilience, determination, and unwavering dedication to one's craft. From his humble beginnings to global stardom, his journey has been anything but ordinary, a testament to his indomitable spirit and enduring charm. 
His life story is not just about his cinematic journey but also about the relationships he has built along the way. Whether it's his friends from the China Drama Academy, his wife and son, or his fans around the world, Jackie's life has been enriched by the relationships he has nurtured. As a time traveler, I have witnessed countless tales of struggle and success. But Jackie Chan's story stands out for its sincerity and dedication. His ability to balance his professional and personal life, while maintaining a deep connection with his roots, makes his journey truly inspiring. Jackie Chan's tale is not just a story of a successful actor. It's a testament to the power of determination, discipline, and resilience. It's a narrative of a man who never lost sight of who he was, despite his soaring fame. A man whose humility, warmth, and down-to-earth persona have made him a beloved figure globally. Until we meet again, farewell.